Prime Minister, recently at the Horiwa lecture, you discussed three main challenges for Singapore. In the first 10 years, you said it was the economy. In the next 25 years, it is population. And in the next 50 years, it would be identity. Yes. All three are related. Yes. The economy depends on the population and the kind of population yes. you have affects identity. Yes. Right. But, and by identity, you mean the collective will of the people, the commitment to build Singapore, to make this our land, our home. Yeah. Let's talk about the economy and population and people first. What is it about economic growth worries you? What worries me is that the easy ways of doing it, uh, we have already maxed out. Mm -hmm. uh, we started off with unemployment so, 50 years ago. So you grow by getting the unemployed people employed. It's not easy, but you create the jobs for them. You build the factories mm -hmm. and life improves. Then we reach full employment. What do you do next? We got the women into the workforce and increasingly women instead of staying at home started working and earning. So we have two income families. Then eventually many women are working. What do you do next? Well, we brought in foreign workers to top us up mm -hmm. so that we could make good in the places where we don't have enough. Now we have got a one in three of our workers are foreign. You really don't want that ratio to go more and more extreme. What can you do next? So what we did next was to have older workers work mm -hmm. 55, 60, 65, which they like to do. But that reaches a limit too. What do you do? The only thing you can do is productivity. Work smarter, work better, deliver the results and improve our lives. And productivity is very tough to do. Mm -hmm. And that's Indeed. what we depend on now.